We just stayed together really as a team. We fought through adversity. Um, and we just uh, went out there and balled. Do you think you have their respect now? Uh, we should. We better. Because if we don't, that's what we're going to do to the next team next Friday. Sending a message to y'all. Uh, obviously, physicality is a big point tonight. How did you guys match up with them physically and, and out physical them? Uh, we've been in the weight room for four years. They've been in the weight room for one year. Uh, they got six seniors. First year playing varsity. They first year coming to my house. We just had to tell them, we just had to show them how I feel. Uh, four years ago, when you guys didn't win a game to now, yeah. what does it feel like? It feels real good, you know, because everybody doubted us. And look how we are now. So, What can this win do for the rest of the season? Uh, really, it can, it can take us a lot uh, far places. You know, we have that win under our belt. We're just going to uh, keep climbing. It meant a lot, man. We worked so hard for this. Our team, man, I, don't, I can't even explain it. We just worked too hard. All them gut boys our coaching did. Aired the whole city and doubted us. Now, look at us, 5-1. Physicality, obviously, a big point tonight. How do you guys match up with them physically? Man, we match up with them in any way. Skilled players and all. We just came out to them and just worked. We balled. I mean, Snyder got a good team. They tough, but we we worked too hard. Not, we couldn't lose that. We balled today. Thank my team. I love them. Uh, what does this chain mean? What does this chain mean uh, you guys? We iced up. That's a turnover team. That's a turnover chain. We iced up. You guys were so excited. Broke it? Man, they broke it. I couldn't believe but We still iced up regardless if it broke or not. <laughs> couldn't be prouder. Two daughters, 62 sons. Love them. Love them to death. We worked hard. We worked hard in the summer. Um, and people just keep doubting us. You know, I know we keep throwing that out there, but we've only lost to the Wager. We're not ranked in the state by the IFCA. You know, we beat Lures, and Lures was ranked above us in the Journal Gazette. So, you know, maybe now they'll start paying us a little respect, but it's all about Snyder's a great program. I got several mentors over there. Kurt Tippmann is a great guy. Uh, it's a great night for Winchester. Wayne Dale. Community, uh, this is beautiful, man. This is beautiful. They talked about it, Craig talked about it. Hadn't, hadn't beaten Snyder their entire careers. Do you yeah. see a little bit extra fire in them? Too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I mean, we got we got athletes, man. We do. Um, we're strong up front on both sides of the ball. You know, nobody picked us. Nobody. Not one. Not one website, Twitter, nothing. You know, Snyder by ten. Snyder by seven. You know, we got 22 seniors. They start six. You know, so our kids took it as disrespect. We took it as disrespect. Our coaches are great. Our coaching staff is a great coaching staff. That's a great one over there, but we do a great job of preparing these kids and working with them. Um, we deal with a different set of kids, and nobody gives us credit for that. And for us to bring them in four years to a place where they can beat a program like that is a great job. Physicality, obviously, a big point. Absolutely. Out, did them physically. Absolutely. How was, Absolutely. How did you do it? Absolutely. Weight room. We did it in June. Um, we got an 85% rule. They don't show up, they don't play. Um, and so, you know, when you get kids that are already athletes and you get them to buy in and get to lifting weights and do the same thing that those guys do over there, uh, it puts you up. It's a chess game. So uh, weight room in June um, and being fast and physical and having them believe and having a coaching staff put a great game plan together.